Hello, welcome to my channel. As some of you may or may not know, I have a Dyson hair dryer. And I'm just going to let you guys know my experience because today I get to go to their supersonic hair place. As my hair dryer decided to go out when I was blow drying my mom's hair. And I'm so unhappy about it because it's an expensive ass hair dryer. I'm not trying to flex. I'm not trying to say like, you know, <laughs> I have a Dyson or whatever. Because I'm not. My man got it for me for Christmas. Like, last year he purchased it november 22nd and that is that well i was doing my mom's hair it just like stopped working out of nowhere if you go on to the dyson website it tells you to do things like clean the filter make sure you're plugging it in in an outlet that works make sure you're not putting it in an extension cord this that and the other we did all that I talked to a customer care person online. They told me I have to go into the store. So here my little ass goes. I'm going to go to the store. I'll let you know what they say. I'm going to show you what my Dyson is doing right now. I hope the warranty is going to cover my dryer. I'm speaking that into existence, hopefully. Um, but, you know, I take really good care of my dryer. It's a really good dryer. I highly recommend it, especially if you're like, you're a hairstylist, it dries hair really fast. The only real complaint I hear people talk about is the fact that the filter like clogs up and then your hair dryer turns off, which is beginning to be an issue. If that's the reason why my hair dryer turned off, I don't know. Like I said, I cleaned it, it's still not turning on. No lights will even turn on. So this is what my Dyson looks like. It has an attachment that I normally use when I'm like blow drying hair. But anyways, it's plugged into the wall. I've reset the button like you would with your hair dryer or whatever. But like literally none of these lights are turning on. I've had it and I've I've used this little baby to go pull this. I don't, I don't, I don't I love my hair dryer. So I will get back on here and I will let you know what they say. It's an hour away, so I'm a little bummed that it's so far, but if that's what it takes to get my Dyson working again, best believe I'm gonna go try to get my Dyson working again. So I'll talk to you guys. I don't know why I keep. How many times are you gonna throw your fingers up, bitch? Anyway, I'll let you guys know what, I, what happens when I get back home. So I just left Dyson and they are going to send me a new hair dryer because I've had the two year warranty. It's all Gucci. The guy basically came out and said, you know, it's pretty much unresponsive, which I was like, duh, I know. Otherwise I wouldn't have brought it. But I didn't say it rude like that because you know, I'm not a rude person. But he was like, you know, it's pretty much unresponsive. So we're just gonna uh, the quickest and easiest way to fix this for you is gonna be just to send you a new one and I was like so you're gonna send a new Dyson to my home and he was like yeah and then I was like okay thank you so much so now I have to wait five to seven business days for my new hair dryer which is I'm not even gonna complain about it you know I asked God if like he could just make sure that it would be covered and it was so I'm looking forward to that I'm super excited thanks Dyson so this is the Dyson they sent me. I was expecting to get another purple one because mine was purple right here. And they said, you know what? I could do you one better. They sent me purple attachments, a black Dyson. Wow. Wow. Wow.